you know, there, there's some programs, sports programs out there, uh, both at the amateur and professional level, have all these unique quotes and all these unique sayings, uh, you know, posted on their locker room, posted in their manuals or whatever the case may be. Uh, we only have one saying, it's, re it's right up here above the door as the players leave to enter the field and that saying it quite simply says tomorrow's promise to no one. We, we uh, definitely treat the sport with respect, we treat the opponents with respect, we don't underestimate anyone. You know, the wins and losses will take care of itself, you know, as long as you give it your best. And, and uh, again, if you have that approach to Mars, the promise to no one, you're going to give it your best. You, you know, this is your last shot. You don't know, as a player, you don't know when your last game is going to be. You could have a career-ending injury, you know, in the very next game. You don't know when that day is going to come. You know, to me, that's very important that, you know, you're going to perform at, at your best. And, and uh, whatever happens, happens. whole year was just a collection of so many great guys together and uh, and I think we were really a team that that had been the first real team that I was on as far as guys hanging out together you know getting along doing well really uh, you know competing really well in practice without you know anybody feeling that they were above anybody else mm -hmm. I think Mike's a really good coach when it comes to not singling out individuals and and saying okay well we're gonna you know we're gonna run uh, this team around this player you know I think he's he's all about the team concept. We had I think 22 guys on the team at that point and no one had a starting spot nothing was guaranteed and you know they put A squad against the B squad in practice and the B squad would beat the A squad you know every now and again and, you know there, there wasn't much difference between the starters and the guys on the bench and so I thought that was really good because everybody was fighting for their position and I think that made us a lot better and, and Mike would he would put guys in and say hey you're out you're you know this guy's in and so so that created a lot of competition in the team, but we were also a really tight team. 